friends welcome to technique this is normal here and in this video we're gonna do a quick hands-on with uh, the samsung galaxy a30 and the redmi note 7 so both the smartphones are uh, the mid-range smartphones and in this video we'll have a quick look at both the smartphones and see which is better device to, to buy and which all features are available on both the phones so uh, right now we don't know the pricing of both the devices but both have a pretty good hardware offered and uh, uh, the samsung galaxy a30 is uh, the device announced uh, at the mobile world congress and the redmi note 7 was announced in china a few uh, weeks back so in this video we'll uh, do a quick comparison of these two devices so first let's have a look at uh, the specification offered by these two phones so we have a uh, 6.4 inches of full hd plus amoled display on the samsung galaxy m a30 while we have a uh, uh, six point uh, 3 inches uh, full HD plus resolution display on the Redmi Note 7. So both the devices have pretty good hardware as well. We have Exynos 7885 Octa-Core chipset on uh, the uh, uh, Samsung Galaxy A30 while we have the Snapdragon 660 Octa-Core chipset on the Redmi Note 7. Both the devices are offered in 3 and uh, 4 GB RAM and offering 32 and 64 GB storage. Now the camera is one of the important aspects. We have 48 megapixel camera on the Redmi Note 7 while we have 16 megapixel camera on the uh, samsung galaxy a30 so looking at the design aspect you can see that the samsung galaxy a30 comes with a plastic build quality uh, even though it feels like glass it's a made of plastic while the redmi note 7 uh, is made of glass so in terms of design and build quality we would say that uh, the redmi note 7 definitely has an advantage so looking at the display quality so we have a 6.4 inches of full hd plus super AMOLED display on the samsung galaxy a30 while we have a 6.3 inches of full hd plus resolution display it's an ips lcd panel on the Sam redmi note 7 so definitely uh, the samsung uh, a30 has an advantage in terms of uh, the display quality which is being a super emulate panel so th that's one area where the samsung takes the lead uh, from the redmi note 7 now let's have a look at the software offered so we have android 9.0 that's android uh, pi update on both the phones we have samsung's one ui on the samsung galaxy a30 while we have uh, uh, the mi ui 10 on the redmi note 7 so after using the software on both the devices we feel the redmi note 7 with uh, the mi ui 10 uh, update uh, feels uh, a bit more snappier and uh, it's, it's more feature rich ui than the samsung's one ui so samsung's one ui is definitely refined and improved but we feel uh, the redmi note 7 definitely has an advantage in terms of the mi ui 10 update so that's the software aspect of these two devices now looking at the performance aspect, uh, we have this Exynos 7885 octa-core chipset on the Samsung Galaxy A30 while uh, the Redmi Note 7 has a Snapdragon 660 octa-core chipset. So looking at the processor, we can clearly see that uh, the Exynos uh, 7885 is not as powerful as the uh, Snapdragon 660 and in terms of the gaming as well, uh, the Redmi Note 7 definitely has an edge over the Exynos 7885. Both the devices have 4 and 3 GB RAM and offered at a 32 and 64 GB storage. So that's the uh, so performance aspect of these two devices. Now let's have a look at the cameras. Now we have a 48 megapixel uh, sensor on the Redmi Note 7. Now that's the uh, Samsung GM1 sensor with f 1.8 aperture and a 5 megapixel depth sensing camera. On the other hand, we have a 16 megapixel camera on uh, the Samsung uh, A30 with 5 megapixel secondary camera. The front camera is 16 megapixel f 2.0 on the Samsung Galaxy A30, while it's a 13 megapixel f uh, 2.0 camera on the Redmi Note 7. So here are some samples we have taken uh, from these two devices. So we can actually have a look at uh, how good the experience is so you can judge uh, from these photos we'll have a detailed comparison once the device is launched so this has been shot uh, at a mobile world congress so we couldn't uh, test the camera in detail but uh, both the cameras definitely looks good Now finally talking about the battery so both the phones have 4000 mAh capacity battery and both comes with a fast charging supported and uh, since we are not tested the batteries we can't really say which is uh, better here but uh, both the devices are really good in terms of the capacity offered and both have fast charging as well. 
so that is the comparison of the redmi note 7 with uh, the samsung galaxy a30 so, so now everything comes down to pricing so as per our information the redmi note 7 uh, definitely will be priced uh, lower than the samsung galaxy a30 but then the samsung galaxy a30 has its advantage including uh, uh, the amoled display that's something which is really good uh, uh, in terms of display performance and uh, it offers great uh, overall experience but uh, having look at uh, the different aspects uh, including the pricing the specifications the features the gaming experience the performance we feel the redmi note 7 definitely is uh, uh, a slightly better offering because of the value for money it offers at this price segment so that was uh, the comparison of the redmi note 7 with uh, uh, the uh, samsung galaxy a30 hope you enjoyed watching this video do hit that like button and also hit the subscribe button for more videos this is normal signing off thanks for watching have a great day